I'm Sadia Basi. I have Himanti Rana Singhi with me. Have I pron pronounced it right, ma'am? Okay. Uh, ma'am, I want to know about the current economic situations in uh, Sri Lanka, the current economic crisis in Sri Lanka, and how the people of Sri Lanka and you guys are you guys are really badly affected from that situation in crisis. I want to know how you guys are managing towards the SDGs in this in this crisis, in this economic crisis. Uh, yes, uh, actually, uh, we are, uh, you know, worse hit, I guess, from the countries in South Asia because uh, we suffered COVID-19, which is a common crisis. And then uh, simultaneously, there was an Easter attack where, uh, you know, uh, our churches and, you know, a few religious places were attacked uh, by uh, some extremists, uh, which really caused, uh, you know, this... Um, uh, these um, very bad consequences on our tourism as well as other assets. And then, uh, well, uh, also, also the Russian-Ukraine war. And stemming from that, uh, we are currently suffering uh, uh, in socioeconomic downturn. And especially this, uh, we call it the dollar crisis, because our, our money had really uh, depreciated in the world market. So therefore, the, the inflation has gone up uh, by 40% now, is exponential increase, and that's uh, food insecurity, and uh, well, food production crisis, uh, and employment crisis. So, I mean, it's a huge, uh, huge crisis situation that the Sri Lanka is, uh, uh, you know, going through. So, uh, with regard to SDGs, uh, it's all like, you know, interconnected. It's just a uh, question for sustainable development. And, uh, well, uh, the emphasis on sustainable development is still there, very much there. The government is very much committed uh, towards achieving SDGs. But uh, because of this uh, dearth of finances, uh, especially uh, the tourism uh, uh, now we're speaking up a little bit, but there was like, you know, it was zero for some time. And uh, then uh, this investor uh, environment was not very uh, 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 conducive. So because of that, uh, there's a tendency to invest on more short-term uh, uh, socioeconomic ventures rather than, you know, long-term ones. So that may pose, uh, you know, uh, issue on sustainability uh, but uh, I must say that uh, in this uh, uh, where the very uh, gray uh, backdrop still countries committed that uh, uh, it will really pursue the 2030 sustainable agenda with uh, you know great difficulty so this is the time that we need help we need help from our neighbors the south southern neighbors as well as the help from northern neighbors. So partnerships are very much in work, very much important at a time like this.